guys, future Queen DJ, Queen DJ here. Um, BTW, gonna go ahead and put this out here now, just in case I get comments on this. Um, BTW, I did a lot of fangirling in this episode, and there are moments where, like, I fangirl too much slash scream. So, here's your PSA, knowing that, like, later on in the episode, aka this reaction, yeah, mm -hmm, at a certain time point, I will be screaming. So, yeah, just keep your volume down low, enjoy the reaction, and I will see you guys all next time. Bye! Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting ring to episode 11 of my Dress Up Darlings. It's gotten to get started in 3, 2, 1. Hold on, this thing is fucking up on me already. In 3, 2, 1, go. Mm, Florida. <laughs> so fucking cute. <laughs> uh, I feel so good. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> well, yeah. Yeah, you know, like every day. Mm hmm. Look how cute he is. Oh, my God. <laughs> Yeah. Hmm? 
Oh my god. Y'all really fucking did that. I can't. I can't. Oh my god. What's up? Yeah, <laughs> well, I mean, with this one, I think you might have to go off of how, like, fan artists do. So I can cute him and die.
って。<笑>嗯。Yeah, she's not like the typical <laughs> succubus, aka what's her. Want to rewatch that? Perfect.
Mm-mm. Why don't you take the pillows and, like... Yeah. There you go. You know what was funny? Okay. So, <clears throat> last week's episode was the last part that I read, right? But, funny enough, this was like, I think, week, <laughs> week two or three 
that scene. <laughs> I got it spoiled. So once I realized that she was wearing that outfit, I was like, oh, that's coming today. I was like, ah! <laughs> so one, I need to put something in the beginning of this video, but like, let me put a little sorry in advance for the fangirling and the screaming because I wasn't prepared. Technically, I was, but at the same time, I wasn't. <laughs> I cannot wait to read this chapter <laughs> so we can read this show is over. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Bruh. Okay. 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 Let let's start. <laughs> Alright, let's start at the part, <laughs> the, like literally the funniest part. I love the fact that Go Drunk was like, okay, I'm just gonna, you're gonna watch TV. That, like, remembering Baby You in a Love Hotel, so come on, of course they're gonna show <laughs> Can we just talk about the part, like, I got triggered for a moment because he did the one thing that, like... <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. So, okay, I used to do this, like, art. So when I was a kid, and I, this is like, mm, kid Deja, middle school Deja, teenage S Deja. All right, so you know, like, how HBO would have, like, certain shows, like True Blood, now it's more like Euphoria, da-da-da, this is set in the third. So, <laughs> so any time... If a sex scene did pop up, I would either do one of two things. I'd mute that bitch or I'd just turn the volume all the way down so I could just go past that scene and such. Because, you know, if, if it's fucked up, because, you know, when the vampire phase came in and it's just like, here, here's all the freaking shows with vampires in it. And it's just, it, yeah. <laughs> I'm pro I am probably not the only one. Is worse. I've seen people on TikTok say the same thing. Because they do that shit and they want to eat cops by their parents. <laughs> I relate to this damn show too fucking much. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> that one. Two. <laughs> Just the moment finally when they're like that fucking close. So fucking close. Get it over with. I need it. Like a drug. Like, uh, like, so this is like how I feel towards, like, with Komi san and the fact that what's his face and Komi san haven't kissed yet. And I'm just over here. I'm like, give it to me. <laughs> Please. <laughs> like, give me a kiss. <laughs> He got a hard on. <laughs> Which I'm not surprised. But, okay. Thank, like, it kind of, like, towards a little bit of the end, it kind of gave me, like, Rent a Girlfriend vibes. But thank God they didn't go, like, that far into it, like, Rent a Girlfriend. I wouldn't have been mad if they did, because, of course, like, it's natural. It's, it's, it's gonna do. Oh, it was so fucking cute. <laughs> but, <laughs> also, let's just talk about the fact is. See, the one thing that I really like about this show is, once again, you take sayus that I have not probably heard in something for a while, and you're like, you know what we're going to do? We're just going to put them in a show together. I, I mean, you did it last time <laughs> with the two magical girls, and now it's this week, and we only have one episode left, and you just, you know, it's just like, you just want DJ to freak out over something again. If I'm not freaking about about a freaking <laughs> voice actor or actress, I'm freaking out over this. But yes, I really enjoyed this episode. It was so fucking good. Cannot wait to read it when, you know, we're done with the show by next week. But 
I, I hate the fact that this is going to be over next week because I really want to see a lot more. I don't know specifically, like, chapter-wise where it's ending, so I just got to go back and figure out what chapter was last week's from where I had stopped reading and then kind of continue from that. So, like, of course, oh, shit. <laughs> so, of course, I'm going to wait until next week, which sucks, but it's okay. And then, you know, I would like to buy the manga. But everybody's bought it everywhere and it's fucking sold out. Amazon won it 20 something, almost 30 fucking bucks for the first volume. The first volume. And I think, what, volume four doesn't come out until next month? Please don't buy it all. I swear to Christ, please don't. Like, damn, let me get my two cents in. Like, damn, let me buy my ish. And then be like, yeah, okay, go ahead, buy it. Be some savages and go to the freaking, go to Barnes and Nobles, go to Amazon, help go to Walmart. It's probably at Walmart. Go to Target and buy it and have it be sold the fuck out. But damn, damn, <laughs> like, give a girl a chance. Give me a chance. <laughs> it's like, y'all gonna make me be a lie. It's gonna be like, how, how the fuck can I compare this? Oh my God, no. Best fucking way. This right here, this is like straight up when it's like, Okay, so when, like, makeup comes out or, like, a really, really nice good lingerie or some shit and all of us girls, we're all ready with our fucking credit cards in that line or when it's a guy thing, whatever a guy wants, we're all in that line with the credit cards and you are right there a day fucking one getting ready to buy this ish and the next thing you know, like, you're in line and then someone, you know, one of your friends or someone comes up and says, hey, I'm gonna refresh this for you and then you're just over here like, you fucking bitch, like, no, you made me lose my place in line and now I gotta do this shit all over again. That's how I feel currently right now. So hopefully, like, well, hold on, when was the last time that I checked Amazon for that? Like, two or three weeks ago? So yeah, I'll probably go ahead and check after this. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 11. <laughs> My dress up darling if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the master squad and of course i will see you guys all next saturday sometime after when i get off of work because also i'm working tomorrow oh let me next week too <laughs> for the final episode bye guys